Well, the results from the 2020 census have been released and Mississippi is one of three states that saw a decrease in population. Illinois and West Virginia were the other two. People are leaving the state for many reasons, but better career opportunities could be one of the top reasons. WCBI's Desmond Matthews looks at what it might take to keep Mississippians at home. I think one of our challenges in Mississippi is keeping our talent. Whether right out of high school or finishing up college, many young people head for the state line when they make that move into adulthood. It's not their fault. Uh, it's our fault. We've got we've got to create opportunities for them so that they can get the gainful employment at the wages, have the place to live be where they want to live. Golden Triangle Development Link CEO Joe Max Higgins says COVID-19 hasn't hurt business in the Magnolia State, but people are still leaving. There hasn't been a lot of loss of industry. Now we're seeing, you know, we're seeing a loss of population for the state, uh, and I think that's something that we all have to uh, uh, acknowledge and we've got to work to figure out how we uh, stop people leaving. According to the 2020 census numbers, Mississippi lost 0.02% of the population. Higgins says for the younger population, it sometimes comes down to the quality of life. Many want a faster pace or more options for their social life. They want to go somewhere where it's cool and hip to live. Uh, we need to have in Mississippi, we need to have some of those locations uh, where they can do that. And I think we're doing that. I think Startville's is uh, doing that. I think Oxford is doing that. He also says more more jobs and better pay could potentially sustain or even increase population. That's why his office is constantly working to recruit businesses and improve the economic development outlook. You gotta give them, give them a job, uh, uh, something to do that fosters their creativity, uh, pays them, shows them that they got a career path. The fact that we're building green energy in the Golden Triangle and, and finding uses for that, I think will help us in the long term. In Columbus, Desmond Matthews, WCBI News. And Higgins says the link is in the process of landing some large deals and hopes those projects will help to keep people here in Mississippi.